Okay, so I'm going to walk down in front of the cabin right now, down the steps. But this is coming from the back parking lot. There's a place here that connects to the back parking pad. And of course, this is where you come up the front and you would park in front of the cabin and go inside. The big retaining wall down here behind the cabin. Okay. like an abandoned build back here. Anyway, that's through the woods. This is coming up to the normal driveway and of course I guess the fence here. Some of it's in disrepair. Doesn't look like it's in too good a shape. Needs to be put back up but apparently that's the edge of the lot. You come here and look at the cabin. You would drive up here on the parking pad, and this is where your two parking model grills are. Somebody wanted to grill out. And then, of course, you would come right up here, up your staircase, and then the front door. Okay? I'm going to try to get pictures without the sun glaring into the lens, so we've still got high contrast. Anyway, cabin looks to be in... Good shape. Looks like everything's good. They got a sort of a privacy area here on the front where you can sit on the balcony and overlook things. And you do have sort of a mountain view here. It's not for a long, long ways off, but it is still there. And through the trees over here, I guess if I were up on the balcony, we could see through there to the other mountain on the other side where there are some mountains over there as well. So, and that's the driveway coming up here from down on Keegan, coming up to the cabin. That's the main entrance. Okay. And if you need me to go inside and do video footage, I can get permission from the agent and see if I can get inside for you. Okay. Good enough.